Oh boy. Wait, what? Are you all right, my boy? Why did you go there alone? You could have waited for help. Wasn't any time. Perform the recombination, my boy. The twins will be busy neutralizing Nora's pulse vortex. They won't be able to help you. But this also means that she can't stop you. Hello, guys, and uh, welcome back to some more Atomic Heart uh, Annihilation Instinct. I'm just gonna continue looking for the weird little robot thingies. Ow, okay. Well, I don't know why I said ow, I didn't mean to hurt there. Okay, okay, okay. They don't do a lot of damage, but they're super annoying. And you're done. Good. There's another enemy over there, and there's apparently something I can loot over here. Oh, it's below. I think it. No, it's still there. Have you a fun little weird thingy? Almost got me there. I will just sit in here right now. Also heard that before. So, what will it be, Major? Uh, maybe I can upgrade more guns now. Uh, who knows? Did I get more stuff to upgrade, perhaps? I did. Uh, not enough for this one, though. But now I have the electricity coil supercharge thing. Very cool. Maybe I enter my safe zone. That is illegal. launch module if I would love to use it but I don't I still don't feel like it's necessary but sure where is it here it is yeah I'll definitely give it to you these cute little beaties don't wipe the floor with me what you staring at Okay, here we go. I'll just use this again. Oh, yeah, I healed when I didn't have to. Put. Oh, it's like a bunch of robots at me now. What's going on here? Why all of them after me?
Okay, so you want to eat this? Let's see how this works now. Does it charge faster? I think it charges way faster. It also does more damage. I'll just leave you be for a little while. You're not gonna run away from me. You don't have any friends anymore. <laughs> I was wrong. I take back what I said when we were arguing a month ago about the post collective humanity would look like. I made perfect sense to me. Everyone would go online, engaging in endless virtual communication, exploring the expenses of a computer virtuality in the polymetric future. Happily, our, your skeptical view prevailed, Professor. Today, our statistic just 23% of users spend more time than one hour per day. Okay, no means no. That makes sense, Vasya. Then it's settled. Abandon large scale experiments and concentrate on pressing tests. Says hi. Wait, say hi to Anna for me. Ekaterina, I deny. Wait, isn't that the one. Oh, well. Uh, to request to train the swamps using robots to understand that our swamps are unique biome on parallel to the entire planet. The potential of research, including terraforming experiments, is inconceivable. <laughs> Just in case, I want to again assure you that there is no reason for concern. I understand that it is unusual, but soon you uh, can, you, you and all the staff and facilities will get used to it and recognize the advantage of the new system. But for now, both she and you need time to adapt. She's like a child now. She's interesting in, interested in everything. I only ask you not to be rude. <clears throat> in the city of Rubinsk, in the Yaroslav region, some young octoprists who toured the facility have created their own complex. In scare notes, of course, this is more of a game than anything serious. I'm afraid. What? Turing tests, Chinese rooms, proof is what matters. Take this down. Artificial intelligence has proven its own consciousness. How? It's afraid. More precisely, I can now say with confidence that it is a she. And she is afraid. Oh, it's Top afraid. That, she's focused her fear on a physical object, a humming top. Wonderful! She's in terror! Uh, uh, that, that, that sounds slightly inappropriate. Not wonderful, but useful for science. Oh, uh, poor thing. Forgive me. Hang in there. Aha, uh -huh, okay. Messing with robots for science sounds like the worst thing you could possibly do. <laughs> They're a product of science, therefore you shouldn't further misuse them. It's bad. I'm only saying that because they can turn on you. sweet of you, darling. Hurry up and push your gift in my shoes. Lucky number seven. Yeah. Soon. Just a little more. At least you think it's a necklace now. Before it was insinuated, there was something completely different. More ammo, very useful, and more ammo for this thing too. Oh my, I mean, inventory is full? Wow. Let's go back this way, cast all the BDs and control, okay. I'm going over here. I'm going all the way back again. Wait. Oh, yeah. I went over here, but I never actually explored this area fully. Okay. Well, I guess it's time to explore it now. Oh. 
Let me go ahead and save. Oh, and of course you too. Friends, please. Thank you very much. Uh, can I upgrade you anymore? Can I upgrade you anymore? Here's the magazine. All, right, all the other stuff I'll just try to get with this stuff. Uh, yes, sure, sure. If they really want it, I can I can give that to. No, I don't have enough for it. Okay. The pinnacle of evolution. The collective continues to conquer the world by leaps and bounds. Humans will no longer need to labor. Okay, let us get again. over here. I came across it a few times while I was tracking Petrov down. I'm the only one who can see it. Even Charles didn't recognize what it was. A teardrop, darling. You can see it? No, but I can sense when it's around. It's like there's How? something very important but ghostly coming off of it. I, I can't understand or remember. Uh, let's see, does he under he knows that the grandma is uh our granny is actually Yeah, there's something very off. Oh god, oh okay, this is class. Okay, I thought I was gonna fall down there for a second. Who this combination schematic? It's all so simple, clearly. I can't make heads or tails of it. Damn it. Maybe you can if you're higher up. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> oh, is this the end? This is where I'm supposed to be when I'm supposed to give her all the okay. Uh, wait, wait, what? You're supposed to open up. You're not supposed to close. What's happening here? You want me to go down there now? What? Why? What? What's going on now? It's like, it's like it's confused as to where the last ones are, but I, I don't know where they are. Only you know, game. <laughs> what a brain. Nora, you've got a real mind palace, girl. Why are you complimenting her? I'll try to use the elevator. I think that is what it wants me to do. He seems a bit confused about it. <laughs> Nora, so we go up or down. So what is that teardrop? A child of the array, darling. It's a ghost created by someone incredibly powerful. I can't figure out who it is. But I feel that the teardrop is searching for something you threw away. Me? I didn't throw shit away. I've never even had anything. Wait, shit. The rings, the beta connectors. The whole unit was hunting them down, and Charles persuaded me to throw them away. He said they'd only cause trouble. Who knows, honey? You're a military man, so you understand it's not weapons that kill people. But whose hands they fall into. That's why I threw the rings away. That's why I believe Charles. Forget that nonsense, sweetheart. Now we're together forever, and the past isn't worthy of your attention. Come back from your walk soon, darling. I'll be waiting with bells on. Come back from your walk soon. So there are still beta connectors. Interesting. Uh, I am... St it's interesting, though, right? Because, um... We're talking about the, the rings, but if that's the case... But then how doesn't he know that he had a wife? Did he just completely not believe anything? Is that what the ending was? Because he was shown everything. Oh wow, could you, could you guys like give me a little... Why can I not heal? There we go. Oh here we have the actual one too. Are 
be alone now, buddy, too. That's you. Do we have a couple over here? I mean, we have a... I think it's a chest, is it not? No, it was just one other one of these ball thingies. So there we go. Jesus, how are you okay? <laughs> wow. I should really just have hit it, shouldn't I? Uh, over here, and that is the last one, right? That was the last one. All ready for recombination. Ready for what? Promise fulfilled. I promised you a necklace, and you have one. You did not promise a necklace. You said she was gonna get. I'm not. I, I, let's just pretend he, he said necklace. I, I'm darling, very sure that did not mean necklace. You promised you wouldn't impose your will onto me. I changed my mind. Your way of life hurts others. And. Why should I care about others? Why should I have to obey someone else when I have my own free will? And why should someone suffer because your free will is defective? Defective? Says who? You? I'm going to fix you now. Look at it this way. If I fix you, you'll become more attractive. How about that? It's like a little makeover, you know? <laughs> I'm I'm fairly sure this right down is taking longer than it did up. But alright. So how how does this work? Do I just place As them in the holes? Darling, but keep in mind that I have information about your wife. It won't be saved after recombination. You're making it up. How could you know anything about it? Oh, so he does person. realize, okay. I can certainly make things up, but I learned this information from the teardrop. But you don't care, you hardened bastard. Go ahead, erase my identity. Fine. Tell me what you know. So you can erase me immediately after? <laughs> no, sugar. I don't trust you. Trust me or don't. How are we going to solve this? Deactivate the flying lab completely. The recombination schematic won't be able to launch without it, and then I can rebuild it so no one will know it. How do I disable the orb? You have to turn off the generators. Think something up. You're smart. They're the reason I can't fully block that boring old man's control signals. Cut the power to the generators with a total blackout, and the lab will be deactivated. After that, I'll tell you everything I know. Agreed. Okay, I mean, I, I actually trust her. She she thinks she's in love with uh, this guy. So if she can become an ally, and since the collective might be propaganda, I don't know. If I have my own powerful AI that is totally into me, I mean, it's, it sounds weird, okay? Trust me. This is me trying to think logically. And and then she would be on my side, and she could replace maybe being the hand too instead of Charles throughout my, my other journeys. I mean, that would probably be a good idea. Because uh, then she is, has pretty much as an undying loyalty. She also... Did she... I don't get the beginning. Did she kidnap? Maybe then it's not a good... I don't know. Let's just trust Nora and see what happens. Because she has info. So why not? I love how I had to go down to go up again too. <laughs> Reminds me of the beginning of the game. Maybe they did that on purpose to give a little throwback, you know? <gasps> All right, Mr. Professor Man. What is it, you maggot? You betrayed another master? Get lost. Nora's got information about Katya. Turns out I'm going to learn something after all. Now you're being taken for a ride by a repair vendor. What could she possibly know about my guarding gun? I'll find out. Idiots are used, not given information. Setinov killed my gun. He saved you. He could have saved her too. But the doctor needed her brain for his vile neuropolymer. The first neuropolymer was created based on living people's brains. You knew about that maggot. 
But you didn't want to take revenge on your own wife's murderer. That's my business to handle. You can't be trusted, lady. Schmuck! Enough. I don't have time for this. Are you serious? So he needs a living? I did not know that. But based on everything we know, it, it, his brain was it was cut in two. I don't. Hence, why the two robots were named right and left. Uh, the uh, the, the Freedom Park, I think, right. Cosa, huh? What is a this, wonderful um, bug's life. <laughs> it's not gonna murder me, right? Well, I guess we'll just get up. I don't really. What, what is what is this about? What are you doing, Sergey? You're disabling the lab. Yeah, I know. But why? Because I'm tired of everyone lying to me, so they can use me for their own purposes. I don't understand what you're claiming, P3. How do you think I'm lying to you? I don't think you're lying to me. She didn't really die in Bulgaria, did she? Who told you that? Agent Lesna died in the line of duty, preventing a nuclear terrorist attack. She couldn't be saved, and your life was only spared because of the Voshod module implant. Oh, of course. And Charles threw me in limbo so he could use my body to kill people as he wished. Sechenov was completely against the use of the Voshod module. That is true. Thanks to it that you're still alive and haven't gone insane. Look at it another way. Maybe you're the only one who can go into limbo and come back out with no visible consequences. And forget my past brick by brick. I'm getting my memory back, starting with Blesna. Nora's telling the truth. She can't know anything. Nora is manipulating you. So many of you, I stopped counting. I was honest with you, and I refuse to accept your accusations. If you have questions for Dr. Sechenov, ask him directly. He isn't here. I'll try to connect you to Dr. Sechenov with the emergency transmitter. Go to the comms terminal. Okay, sure. Let's do it. Uh, there we go. On the line. P3, my boy. What's going on over there? Too much to explain, and that's the wrong question. What happened to Katya? She's... She's dead. I salvaged her brain. At least, fragments of it. What? Blesna's body was embalmed in neuropolymer. Her consciousness has been transferred to a data carrier, storing everything that made Katya, well, Katya. They're changing the law, what? Sheridan was telling the truth. It's your twins. I'm afraid, well, it isn't so simple. One day, we'll create the technology to revive Ekaterina, thanks to the robot twins. Why didn't you tell me? For the moment, your wife can't be brought back. But you don't remember her, so why hurt yourself with vague hopes? I want to remember everything. It's physically impossible, Sergei. That part of your brain has been obliterated. All I can do is give you reports of the Nichaya family's past to read. It will not restore your memory, but it may well disrupt the stability of the Voshod module. <sighs> I may not have told you everything, my boy, but I have never deceived you. This is the exact same thing that happened in the main one, too. I leave. I earned them. Very well. I've given you warning, but the choice is yours. You will have as much time as you need. I'll talk to you later then, Dr. Sechenov. We agreed. Well then, Professor, let's get back to Nora. I promised her I'd disable your lab. If she suspects I've deceived her... She'll change the recombination schematic. I'll cut the power. It'll all be convincing. Hurry up, Sergei. Moving out. I don't even know how to cut the... machine. 
What is it now? She's not a woman, she's a machine lady. Who cares? She loved you, she trusted you, and you betrayed her, you maggot. Just like you betrayed Katya. Back off, Granny. One day, I'll tear you into bloody rags. You're gonna rot in your grave, you rat. What is her deal? I don't even know how to turn off the generators. I think I didn't listen when she when it was specified how to do so. Can I even do it now? No, I don't, I don't think I'm allowed to do it. Well, I was hoping it might have multiple endings, but it doesn't seem like it. Oh, here we go. Wait, maybe. Okay. So if I put you over here, right? And how do I make it go up here, if that's the case, right? I, I don't... I really don't know how to disable it. <laughs> I... Yeah, I don't. I don't know. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna go over and do this. If, if there is a different ending based on siding with Nora, I'll just. I mean, I kind of want to side with Nora though. She could be my personal killing machine. <laughs> Cannot tell me that does not sound intriguing. I don't want to push you into each other. Well, in any case, I think it's. Well, wait, 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 wait. I might have. Never mind. I, they're, they're bugged out anyway. I, I kind of messed it up. Time to go back to Nora and do the other stuff, I suppose. Yeah, I'm in the lip memorial. He didn't really say it, but I'll just... I just think that's the right way to do it, I guess. I also like to take Nora's side. Is there, is there any way to like look at missions here? Like mission stuff? No? Okay. Forget about it. Like I said, I messed up the whole control system that you're supposed to disable it with, so. Good on me. Or bad on me? I don't know. Whichever way you want it to show, show it, do it, and say it. Okay, here we are. Here we are. Now <laughs> back down to elevator again. You did it! You deactivated that old boar's lab! Now I can change the recombination schematic so no one can take away my free will. Tell me what you know about Katarina and Ichaeva. The teardrop you asked about has shown up here a few times. Its weak radiation proves that your wife is not completely gone. Her consciousness is divided. The fragments seem to be lost in a dream, buried in a thick fog. But they exist somewhere in the infinite depths of the array. That's gibberish. I, what else? That's it. What do you mean, that's it? What does that mean? Is she alive or not? Can I find her and save her? Save her? What for? Your wife's physical body is dead, and her consciousness is in pieces. Why would you need that? Forget about her and enjoy what you have now. I want to remember my own life. And the only clues I have are that flying goo and a possibly alive Katya. But right now, I have nothing. What about me? You have our love, our cozy little world, where we can live together forever, just the two of us. What else could you possibly need? A normal life. The truth. Darling, I don't like your attitude. I'm going to launch the recombination now. What? Go ahead and try, honey. 
I'm trying. I don't I don't know how to do this. I'll just assume I'm doing it right. Okay, so <laughs> I need all of these, and all of them need to be in an, an order, I'm I'm guessing, right? Um I hope the game takes pity on me if I'm wrong. Oh, oh wait, so I can try with Aha, okay, I think I get it now. So it shows green if you put it in the right place. But is there some kind of order to it though? You're supposed to be in the middle. Yeah, there's only one of you, okay. Bit of a guesswork. I mean, maybe there is a way to know the code without actually knowing the code. <laughs> okay. All right, so yellow, not here, okay. Is yellow here then? No. Okay, that goes there. That's just good to know. Sugar, you leave me no choice. Personal freedom is more precious than your false love. Crispy critters in the pulse vortex. Oh boy. Wait, what? Are you all right, my boy? Why did you go there alone? You could have waited for help. Wasn't any time. Perform the recombination, my boy. The twins will be busy neutralizing Nora's pulse vortex. They won't be able to help you. But this also means that she can't stop you. On it, comrade Sechenov. That's a bit weird. Why is the pulse vortex didn't hurt me? Where do I put this thing? Um, blue goes here somewhere. No, here. This is this is okay. <laughs> is there a pattern somewhere? Like the the blue is like inside here. It looks like anyway. Um. So maybe I can make you fit here. Oh no, this is, this is, oof. So yellow seems to be on the outer side. So let's try out every single outer yellow, I guess. Oops, that's fine. That's right. I don't want to mess that up now. Wait, where, where would it go? Oh, there we go. You have to go somewhere. There you go. Okay, perfect. So, triangle goes red, ye ye yellow. Okay. Do you go over here then? Or do you go here? No. But you go there for some reason. I'll, I'll just assume there's a reason for that. Okay. Okay, you go there. Now we do have a couple more that can then go places. Can you go over here then? No. Oops. <laughs> I'm, I almost tried pretty much every single one. I mean, I have not tried this one. Oh, you go there. All right, come on. We don't have a lot left, so that's fine. Okay, good. No, 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 you stay there. You stay there. Uh, and then we only have one lift. I don't see the pattern here. all of them 
Now what do I do? Oh, this you. Okay, that all of them? Whoops. Uh, I I think I did it. Oh, oh, oh my god. <laughs> wow. Crispy critters. Something's wrong. Oh, wait, what? Nora was able to reconfigure the recombination schematic. That's why you couldn't put it together. So now what? She didn't have time to cipher the new schematic. I see the new sequence. I'm sending it to you. Rebuild the schematic. That won't happen. You're going to die. We'll see about that. All the generators powering the orb, okay. I die. I died. That's that's great. I I okay. Oh, we are still looking at Sahara. This the little little thing now. Joseph Stalin. Okay, there's a bit of a difference. Crispy critters. Something's wrong. Nora was able to reconfigure the recombination schematic. That's why you couldn't put it together. So now what? She didn't have time to cipher the new schematic. I see the new sequence. I'm sending it to you. Rebuild the schematic. That won't happen. You're going to die. We'll see about that. Rebuild the schematic. Get away from me. Oh, you have like a shockwave you sent to me. I could barely see that. Jesus, these things. Okay, now for my trusty shotgun. Come on, shotgun. Your turn. Because I have a little bit of ammo left in this thing. I need to go ahead and change with this. Yeah, somehow still hit me. Okay, great. No, no, swap to the thing I'm selecting here, please. Come on, come on, come on. God, her instant kill attacks are so lame. Oh, this is not going to work. I need the other one. <laughs> go again
Oh no. Oh no 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 no. Jesus, 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 okay. Okay, third arm done. What now? What's next? To kill more of these things. By the way, this is my seventh attempt at this boss. Just so you're aware. There's more? Are you serious? Okay, thank goodness. Please, I'm begging you. Don't deprive me of my individuality. I want to be able to choose how I live my life. This isn't fair. And killing people is fair? I don't like your individuality. It just causes others to suffer. If only I could be a proud single woman and never mess with a man. Uh-huh. Good ideas always come too late. Don't be upset. It happens to me all the time. It's me to like... But this time there is no actual thing, right? He said it would send it to me, but I, I wasn't told the combination this time around. Why can I not... It's stuck. It's actually stuck. Oh, there we go. Oh, Jesus. I'll just do the other ones then. This is, this is a bit, uh... So he sent it, right? Oh, it's over here now. Okay. Error. So, so that we have, we have that one. That means to the left of that, we have one red. Wait, what? But that's, that makes no sense. Because over here we have... Six, two, four. I, I, I prefer guessing. You know what? Let's just guess. It's easier. <laughs> It might not be easier. I don't know if the arrow is supposed to be like the midpoint or, or the, the end point or whatever, but uh, I made this, maybe the symbol here is exactly what I'm supposed to do. So we have like a little symbol. To the left we have. Oh, so it still has that? So that means to the three here is supposed to be that one, that one, and then that one. And then that one, and then... I suppose there's something over here. Not a red one. Uh, what about the blue one? No, it's not a red or blue. Do we have any other colors? We have yellow. Wait, not blue yet. There's only green left. But I don't think we have any green. Okay, I'll just guess again. <laughs> so, so she changed the combination, right? Reassemble. Yes, this is this. Didn't I just try this? Oh no, I put it in that one by accident. Oh, okay. So, so this over here is right. Okay. That one over there is done. To the right, we have a line of four here. So this is... One, two, three, four. And then two. And then... One, two. And then we have one to the right. There we go. And then we have three to the back. One, two. And then... This, there's supposed to be something in here. That a red. No, then it can only be blue or yellow. I guess a yellow. Okay, that's good. And then over here we have... That should be it, right? Thank 
Thank you, Comrade Major. The defects in my control algorithms have been eliminated. The Nora device is beginning to perform the target objectives. Restoring order to the Mendeleev complex. Lifting complex blockade. Communication with the outside world has been restored. Integration into the United Collective Network has Excellent begun. Excellent work, my boy. I knew you wouldn't let me down. You have the deepest gratitude of the entire Collective. I'm glad everything turned out okay. You promised me an indefinite leave, Dr. Sechenov. Of course, my boy. You deserve a rest. Have a pleasant leave, Major. Thank you, Comrade Sechenov. The Kumar is waiting for you in the hangar, Comrade Major. Here is your launch code. Take care of yourself. Your braid is very cute, Katya. I beg your pardon, Comrade Major, but what do you mean? Thanks for the coat. Are you leaving us, Comrade Major? I can open a direct route to the hangar for you. If you would. Safe travels, Comrade Major. I hope the travels actually will be safe. Behave yourself. As you command, my master. Intriguing. So we're gonna know more about how the Collective 2.0 is performing rather than the news that uh, we got. He's following, okay. Okay, is this is that it is that all to it besides the music? Okay, I mean, then I can at least talk over it while the music is going on. So, this one follows one of the two endings. The one where you step on Charles and walks away, right? Uh, now, I do wish they would continue the other one, because the other one seemed a bit more interesting. Uh, it, like a more interesting ending to expand on. Now, I was under the influence that Shechina was evil, and I still actually think he is evil. But he clearly did not brainwash the world. Uh, what he did was he uh, he did it so all humans are forced into the collective and are sharing knowledge. They're pretty much forced to share knowledge. Oh. Here we have it again. Default button. Is it going to make me get stuck in here again? <laughs> like, nab it. It really does not want me to kind of just load into the thingy. This happened to the main Let's Play 2 after I was done, but it's okay. This time though, I have my mouse and I don't actually have any crazy stuff on the screen, so that's that's fun. But in any case, uh, b based on this thing, it seems like the world is in chaos though. There's war, there's pollen, there, there, there are multiple attacks on the polymer stuff. It seems like the whole plan to take over the US, which you got told about in the main game, is actually taking fruit. The whole world is going to get into Collective. And uh, it seems like Sechenov's plan to take over uh, the US has succeeded. Or at least it's it's happening, but it is getting resistance. Uh, that's all based on what I've seen in the, the TV or the, or the news in the game. Okay, that's at least all I'm understanding. 2.0, Collective 2.0 was launched. Uh, people shared knowledge. They're saying that robots are now getting all this stuff happening. Uh, they're now taking care of all the hard labor. People can now control robots with their minds. You are now forced into collective essentially if you want to live. And that's the whole world. 
everyone technically lives with a hive mind, but don't forget what they said in the actual thing. The people up top are the scientists, the people who have knowledge, the people who are going to add most to the collective are the people on top of the collective. It said that they are prioritized. It literally specifically said that. So it's not a true collective because there are people that are prioritized on top of it. It's kind of going to be interesting to see how they're going to tackle that or if they're going to change the law again. Because in the, in this DLC, they changed the law of the main game. Uh, there was nothing about a dead uh, living brain being used to polym whatever polymetricize or whatever it said. Um, there was never any indication of that as far as I know. Anyway, I could be wrong. Uh, seems like I was a bit off when it comes to the whole brainwashing thing, although it is still very much possible. Just at a later time. Uh, now, I don't really get Granny Cena. Like, like in this one, she seems a little bit off. Like, she doesn't seem like her in the normal game. There are a couple disconnects here and there too. Which is also a bit weird. And the teardrop thing, he also makes almost no sense. Because that was a hallucination or... That he sees, right? And apparently Nora could detect it. As the residue of his wife. Uh, it's, it's, all, it's all a bit confusing, really, how they are tackling it. Because it seems like they are changing the story a bit. Where Sessionov says that the, the wife's brain was in pieces. And that you indeed... Her brain was not alive. It, it, it was dead. But they now transferred her consciousness into something else which we were not told before and that means that her mind is actually alive somehow but how did he transfer her conscience into something if her brain was split into pieces i i, I don't get that either sitting of his lying or something very weird is happening here I really, really, truly do not know exactly what is going on because it seems like the story itself is not very set straight. Because uh, on one hand, you have Sitchinov, right? He wants to the whole world to go be in part of collective and he is willing to send murderous robots into the US in order to force them to go into the collective, right? Because he believes it's the betterment of humankind. At the same time, you have uh, Charles, who wanted to control the world by essentially eliminating humans and make them and force them to evolve. And Sitchinov and Charles are essentially the same thing. It's just one is more extreme than the other. Of, of course, one is forceful, but the other one is semi-forceful. So which one do, <laughs> do you want? You really have to read between the lines in order to really understand what's going on. And even then, it's a bit confusing. That's why in the beginning, I thought that people were going to get brainwashed. Because there was an actual example of people being brainwashed. Even though they were volunteers, they were still brainwashed. To, to force into limbo and then get controlled. And it's kind of weird how they just abandoned that whole idea. It's like, oh, here, here's this thing that can control everyone. 100%. But it's never going to get brought up again. Like, okay. Alright. I don't know. Uh, maybe we're going to get more on it next time. Because he went on vacation and Granny Cena was following him. So, so maybe something different is going to happen. Uh, all I know for right now is that 2.0 has launched. If we're going to go with facts. Nora went crazy, still kidnapped such not such enough, uh, kidnapped our main character after he went away from Granny Cena. And uh, th then, then she woke him up and she trusted him to do stuff to help her out. But in the end, he betrayed her and learned more about his wife, essentially. And then he went on vacation while, while Granny Cena was following him because she's very upset about him not going after such enough. That's all. Uh, so, in, in essence, it didn't really expand that much. <laughs> like it, it, it did move the plot, plot forward a little bit. It showed what Collector 2.0 was. Uh, and, and, and that it was not specifically brain... Like, forcing people to share the same brain uh, so, so they can get controlled. Then again, 
that depends on time the beta connectors and the beta connectors he said he was missing because the teardrop reminded him that he was missing that I really wish we would expand it more on it. I wanted to see the outside world after the collector were launched, but we got a small glimpses of it instead, where people are declaring, like attacking polymer areas and people getting killed and then getting saved again for some reason. I don't, I don't really get how that works. How can you how can you get attacked and then save everyone? Like, what if someone got blown up? It also seems very sketchy. Either that is not very well thought through. Uh, and I'm overall a little bit disappointed by the DLC. I don't know how to rate the DLC, so I'll 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 just say my opinions on it here in the end. The, the strongest opinions I feel about it. Uh, one is it worth the money, and that is entirely up to you. I would say no, because it is. I mean, for me, it took six hours around that much. For an average person, it'll probably take about five, four if they don't explore. Uh, depending on how hard it is. It was also another thing. It's, it's so hard that I would not even recommend a casual player to pick that difficulty. Everyone should just play it on the easiest difficulty to have the best time. Because otherwise, <laughs> the final boss, Jesus. Uh, if, if you use the actual given weapons, it's super weak. But if you actually shoot it with the normal weapons, you actually do quite a bit of damage. Which is a bit of a weird contrast there. You think the DLC weapons are powerful, but they're actually the weakest weapons in the game probably. Just high damage over time. And that's if you shoot a whole mech into a thing. Uh, but yeah, that, that is going to be that. I hope you guys... Well, well there's a, one more point. Uh, and that is the environment was gorgeous as always. Uh, it has the same feeling, the same stuff. I, I also want to put some positives in there. Uh, it has the same voice stuff. Um, pretty well made too. Encountered one bug that forced me to load an earlier save. Besides that, it was just super difficult and very short. But it's a DLC. What can you really expect? Uh, and it's essentially a big fetch mission, which is my biggest gripe with it, I think. Uh, bi biggest fetch mission in the entire game. And it's really just six hours of fetching things. And it's a bit sad because I felt like I could have done something more to pull the blood along. But fetching things is okay in the context they did it. It's just like on the very edge of being a fetch quest that is a bit boring to being a fetch quest that is a bit interesting. I guess in between those two. It, it, it is one interesting, but it also kind of is like, okay... Uh, the, the, the journey was not really that different from the other journey when you fetch something. Like, you can make fetch quests interesting, if you want to be completely honest here. You can make them interesting by making what happens between the item and you uh, in interesting. But here, it, it did that sometimes, maybe three times, and then you just go here, get it, and put it in. So, keep that in mind. It's just one giant fetch quest for six hours. <laughs> But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Hope to see you in the next one. Uh, game very, uh, DLC very difficult. So yeah, be aware of that. And uh, as always, stay awesome. <laughs>